So this past week we got some news from Warren Buffett when he announced that he took a stake in Chubb, which is a life insurance company. And that stake was over $6 billion. And as the news hit the headlines, we had a huge spike in price. Now before we look at the charts, let's get into the details on this purchase. So the famed investors, Berkshire Hathaway, first bought into the insurance giant in the third quarter of 2023, but secured regulatory permission to keep the holdings confidential to finish building its stake. This is pretty crazy. So he asked the SEC, hey, I'm buying a bag of chub, but please don't tell the markets. Buffett's company initially purchased 8.1 million chub shares worth 1.7 billion at the end of September, then boosted the position to 20 million shares valued at 4.5 billion in December. It raised the bet to 25.9 million shares worth 6.7 billion at the end of March, according to SEC filings. Assuming Berkshire hasn't touched its stake since then, he owns about 6.4% of Chubb, and the company's worth roughly a billion dollars. Now, Chubb operates in 54 countries and provides everything from property and casualty insurance to health insurance, reinsurance, and life insurance. It's a stock that Buffett will feel comfortable owning, being that Berkshire has a large insurance business with subsidiaries like Geico and Allegheny. All right, so again on the news, we had a gap, but not a go. As you did have some profit taking taking place um, when the news broke and when the markets opened. But let's start with the bigger picture. And this is the monthly chart. And again, what was resistance became support. And as price moved higher, it created another level of interest at $240. Now let's go down to the weekly chart so we can see that $240 a bit better. You did have uh, this rally base rally out. So that's what we call weekly buyers. Essentially, this is just some sideways price action. And then you got the burst higher on the news this past week. Going down to the daily chart, you did have some daily sellers. But price is still to the upside. So anything, this would have been a, just a short term. Uh, counter trend trade and what I like about this level is you did have a nice M pattern which is a reversal pattern typically when you break the trough price re retest and then continues in the direction but again you are in an uptrend you have the 200 day moving average moving up and to the right so, if you follow Buffett and you take his trades, the chart is suggesting don't buy now. <laughs> Again, Buffett was buying some in March and then some in December at much lower prices. Name of the game is buy low and sell high. So, with price at all time highs, wait for a pullback to the origin of the breakout where it took out all time highs at 260 before going long thanks for watching subscribe please like the video